For millions of people across the UK, their homes have become a prison. They're drowning in a sea of clutter, waste and grime. With social care struggling, best friends and cleaning obsessives, Joe Cook and Al Law are hitting the road. Ready to listen and bring some joy. <laughs> but for Joe and Al, no job is too big. They're not afraid of getting stuck in. Working with the professionals. You got two to give people the chance of a fresh start. Oh. <laughs> Joe and Al are back on the road, but this time they haven't got far to go. They're on the way to see 59-year-old biker Chaz, who struggles with his mobility. To work through the layers of dirt and neglect, Joe and Al call in local professional Roy and his crew of eager cleaners. Luckily for the team, Chaz has a very clear idea about what has to stay and what's to go. Now the house has been cleared through, the deep clean can begin. Later that week, it was Al's turn to tackle a project of her own. Al is going to visit Tracy in Somerset, who's got herself into a terrible muddle. The scale of the job is much bigger than Al expected, and she's clearly going to need some help. So she called up a mate from the Midlands. Expert cleaner Eddie. At Chaz's house in Essex, Joe and Al faced a massive task. Joe's worried that Chaz has given over a whole room to his dogs. Alison's in Somerset helping Tracy clear her house and most importantly her spare room. So her daughter will have a place to stay when she visits. Tracy's spare room was a dumping ground, unloved and full of clutter. But now it's an oasis of calm ready for her daughter to come and stay with her. Downstairs, the front room was covered in years of dust and pet food. But with Al's transformation, Tracy now has a living room her husband would be proud of. And finally, the kitchen needed a lot of TLC and a good scrub. Because of Al's determination, Tracy can now use its full potential. Helping Chaz clear up his home in Essex was one of Joe and Al's biggest ever jobs. After days of work, Al still scrubbing surfaces and Joe still finding cat poo. It's the final curtain for Joe and Al at Chaz's house. Okay. The man himself is back to see the results of their hard work. Wow. Just wow. Chaz's dining room was covered in grime and tons of clutter. Now Chaz can entertain again without being embarrassed. The kitchen was a dangerous health hazard with piles of unwashed dishes and years of built up grime. But after Joe and Al got stuck in, it looks almost new. 